What's up, YouTube? This video is sponsored by Policy Genius, and there's no better time than now to apply for life insurance because it's not just the temperatures that are rising. Life insurance rates can go up each year you wait. Policy Genius makes it easy to compare quotes from over a dozen top insurers all in one place. Eligible applicants can get covered in as little as a week thanks to an award-winning policy option that swaps the standard medical exam requirement for a simple phone call. This exclusive policy was recently rated number one by Forbes. Higher than options from Ladder, Ethos, and Best Style. Make sure you guys take advantage of this. Getting started is easy. First, head to policygenius.com slash chrisane. In minutes, you can work out how much life insurance coverage you need and compare personalized quotes to find your best price. When you're ready to apply, the Policy Genius team will handle the paperwork and scheduling for free. Policy Genius never sells your information to other companies, and Policy Genius does not add extra fees. Head over to policygenius.com slash Chris Sane. And remember, when it comes to life insurance, it's nice to get it right. Okay, guys, let's talk about it, guys. Listen, listen, when the market is doing what it's doing, you want to make sure that you are positioning yourself in a way that you can withstand whatever the market is doing. So if inflation, for instance, if inflation is at play, guys, you need big tech. Big tech is your hedge. Big tech is how we are going to play inflation. And so if you guys think about it, if you wonder how you weather the storm or how your portfolio can maintain its value when everything else around you may be going down you need to make sure you're overweight in big tech okay so it's important that you guys understand no matter what the day brings it's about how you structure your portfolio on your journey whether it's the 100k or whether it's just your investment journey in general and as i often say you need your long-term plays aka your pillars Okay, that's just what's going to help you maintain the value of your portfolio. It's the reason why I'm never going down heavily, no matter what the market does. That's the one thing I want to show you guys too, is your portfolio diversity. Never have more high risk plays than you do your long term growth stock plays. Never have more money in your high risk plays than you do your long term and slash your pillar plays. Okay, that's just important again it's a small thing but it's a big thing okay you want to make sure that if it's a long-term hold for you if it's a stock that you know you're riding to the wheels fall off that you have that one heavily invested in versus again having a high risk play you put ten thousand twenty thousand fifty thousand that and maybe even worse you might buy every single one okay try to avoid that if you can strike a balance have 10 plays total if you can Try to make sure you have your Apples, your Microsoft, your Facebook as your bigger plays and your other positions, a lot smaller size of your portfolio with the thought that they can run a lot higher. OK, let's take a look at a few plays that you need to make sure that you tap into ASAP. Speaking of Apple, guys, I'm kicking this one off with a play that I think you guys need to have as one of your pillars. OK one of your long-term holes as well as a play that's going to do well against inflation and when i say well i just mean it won't drop as much as some of your other high risk plays okay so follow me on that guys what i'm talking about when i say do well it may just stay stagnant this play has been stagnant for the last nine months before this run up to the 140 level okay however i'd rather be still then for 60%. If you agree with me, let me know, okay? So Apple would be a type of play that should serve as a pillar of your portfolio. So that means if you're gonna put some money in your portfolio, if you had $10,000, okay? You would wanna put 8,000 of that 10,000 into Apple, and then you would wanna put the 2,000 into your high risk play, your Palantir, your charge point, your BNGO, Do that, that makes sense, okay? I just wanna make sure I get you guys in the best position to win and maintain your portfolio value so that you don't see your portfolio fall even on red days, even on sell-offs, okay? Check this out, another one to consider, Microsoft, okay? This is a big dog, AKA a pillar 
a stock that should be a pillar of your portfolio okay this one's currently sitting at 280 as you see this one was up on the day check out what's up today check out what's down okay but again if you don't choose apple you may consider microsoft okay and you want a same example if you're going to have a portfolio of ten thousand dollars you want to have eight thousand into something like this two thousand into something like your high risk play a palantir a bngo a tattoo shop i'm hoping that makes sense i'm gonna keep pounding this home one more just for the road is facebook okay ticker symbol fb this one currently sitting at 351 dollars but look at this look at how on a down day when everything else is down look at wouldn't you guys rather be down this than four percent in your play this is kind of stuff i want you to pay attention to don't get all red days are not the same all plays that are red are not the same some are barely down look at how close to the line this is okay some are barely down okay some are down four percent seven percent ten percent it's levels okay this is one you want to consider this is probably the best of them all but if i had to choose you should at least choose one of these if not all three of these that'll take up three of your 10 total plays you should have now the rest of the seven you want to be very surgical with how you construct it okay listen guys i'm just trying to put you in position to win show you how to properly structure your portfolio as an investor and or on this 100k challenge okay this is what is truly all about up next guys we have our word of the day and our word of the day is rolling corrections listen guys i want to talk to you about rolling corrections i brought this up in the past but just in case you guys missed it i want to circle back and touch on it again in the stock market whether in this market particularly okay you will have what's known as rolling corrections meaning they will just roll from sector to sector lumber will get hit then commodities will get hit utilities will get hit momentum will get hit tech will get hit industrials will get hit it's just rolling on to the next sector okay be mindful understand this market is not like any other market and so for you to have a different psychology about how you go about this okay that's what it comes down to and i don't want you guys getting flustered or too deterred because you don't recognize fully what's going on okay so again just be mindful but more importantly have your strategy in place know how you want to play it know what plays you want to be in and know what plays you're willing to ride to the wheels fall off in aka staying 10 toes down in like we say over here because it makes a difference when you're going through the fire okay it makes a difference and again minimize all the high risk you are trying to jump into and and play and make sure you got some balance with the type of plays we talked about today apple being one microsoft being another facebook being another i could have named google i could have showed you amazon the list is long but i want you guys just to get in the mindset of let you at least have one of those if not two of those don't hurt to have all three just to make sure you got three big dogs as part of your play especially if you know you go a little haywire with getting all the high risk plays all the high momentum type plays okay listen guys we make videos like this every day so if you like this one make sure you check out the next one remember most people see the end result very few consider the journey do me a favor make sure you like and subscribe to the channel don't forget to check out policygenius.com slash chrisane at the link below or at the pinned comment and i'll see you all in the next one